this is analogy question so in this video we have to learn all type of problems so let's solve find the relation between this question 2 3 5 or prime numbers so the given options are also prime numbers so what are prime numbers 2 3 5 7 11 13 17 and so on so mark the numbers 2 3 5 so next number is 7 so options option D is correct answer find the relation between this question take 2 2 plus 1 is 3 so take 3 3 square is 9 9 so same as 6 6 plus 1 is 7 and take 6 7 square is take 7 7 square is 49 that is option C is correct answer Find the relation between this analogy question. Take 23 and 14. Add sum of the digits. So the relation is sum of digits are same. So take 23, 23. Add digits. We get 5. Same. 14. 1 plus 4 is 5. Sum of digits are same, so take 71, 71, add digits, you get 8, so we have answer, so check, cross check the options, option A, 1 plus 5 is 6, this is wrong, option B, 3 plus 2 is 5, so this is also wrong. Option C, 2 plus 8 is 10. This is also wrong. We have 8. So, check. Last option, D. 2 plus 6 is 8. So, 8. 8, same. So, D is correct answer. So, find the relation between this analogy question. Take 9, 9 into 2 is 18 and take 7, 7 into 2 is 14. So 14 not in present in the option, so this is wrong method. Take 9, 9 cube is 729. So add digits, you get 9, 18. 18, take 7, 7 cube is 343. Add this digits 3 plus 4 plus 3, you will get 10. So, option D is correct answer. Find the relation between this analogy question. Take the relation. The relation is 2 and 4. Take relation 2 and 4. 2 square is 4. So, same. Take 9 relation. 9 square is 18. So, answer option D. Find the relation between this analogy question. Take 144. So, square root of 144 is 12. So take 12, add digits, you will get 3. 3. Same way, 2 to 5. Square root of 2 to 5 is 15. So add digits, 1 plus 5, you get 6. So option B is correct answer. Find the relation between this analogy question, take 561. 
five six one. Multiply these digits five six and one. You get thirty. Thirty. Same way one fifty four. Multiply these two digits. You get twenty. That is option C is correct answer. Find the relation between this analysis question. Take two. Two square is four. So take four. Write twice and add four plus four. Eight. Same way. Take eight. Eight square is sixty-four. Write twice and add. Write one twenty-eight. So. B is correct answer. Find the relation between this analogy question. Take eighty-five, eighty-five. Subtract individual digits and square. That is three square. Three square is nine, nine. Same way, ninety-five. Nine minus five is. Nine minus five all square, so four square. Four square equal to sixteen. Option B is correct answer. Find the relation between this analogy question. Take four. Take four. Four cube is sixty-four. So add this digits six plus four equal to ten. Ten, same way. Six cube is two one six. Add these digits. Two plus one plus six. We'll get nine. Option A is correct. Find the relation between this analogy question. Take twelve. Twelve square is one forty four. Add these digits. One plus four plus four would get nine. Nine. Same way, fourteen square is. One. Add these digits. One plus nine plus six. Sixteen. That is option C. Find the relation between this analogy question. Take three. Take three. Three into four is twelve. Five into four is twenty. Twenty not present in the option, so this is wrong method. Take three. Three square is nine. Add the same digits to nine. We'll get twelve. Dual. Take five. Five square is twenty-five. Add the same digit to result. You'll get thirty. That is option C is the correct answer. Next question. Find the relation between this question. So four, nine, and twenty-five are square numbers. So, what are square numbers? Two square, three square, and five square. Two, three, five are prime numbers. So, the next prime number is two, three, five. After five is seven. So, seven square is forty-nine. That is option D is correct answer. Find the relation between this analogy question. Take ten. Ten square is hundred, and take hundred. Hundred minus one is ninety-nine. Ninety-nine. Take nine. Same trick. Nine square is eighty-one, and take eighty-one. Eighty-one minus one equal to eighty. So, option B is correct answer. Next question. Find the relation between this analogy question. 
take 81 subtract this individual numbers 8 minus 1 equal to 7 so take 7 write twice and add them you will get 14 14 take 72 subtract individual numbers you will get 5 so double the number you will get 10 option c is correct answer find the relation between this question look at the numbers 12 half is 6 so take 1 root 6 12 half is 6 and take 147 take 14 14 half is 7 so same like 168 take 16 16 half is 8 so same same like this check the options 22 half is 11 but it is 6 this is wrong 20 half is 10 but this is 8 this is also wrong 30 half is 15 but it is 7 wrong 8 half is 9 so this is right so option D is correct answer